Welcome to another unit guide book. I hope you guys will enjoy. Let's do this. So, today we cover a unit I truly hate. A unit that should be banned from Global League. A unit that should either get nerfed or don't exist at all. Now, I, I see you coming. A lot of you will tell me, Oh, it's legit, it's good, it's easy to shut down, it's fair, uh, it's not that good. You won't convince me. No, no, no. So, here is my opinion. This is my personal experience. I am not a high-ranked player. I'm pretty low. And I don't care, because I play for fun. I don't even look at the replays on the turn. Sometimes I do when I know my opponent is good and I want to give a good game. But even there, sometimes I, I just don't think about that. So, I say this to enforce the idea that I don't care about competitive play. I play for fun. I know a lot of people that... Uh, play very competitive and they want to be the best of, of the best I will tell you this they are top players they are really really good but even then they can lose even when you're on the top of that chain other people on the top of that chain can beat you so don't try to be the best you are not so keep for yourself your analysis of all stealth are fair. I don't find them fair. With that being said, uh, leave a comment if you really insist. That will piss me off, but I won't even take the time to read it. Um, now, I can sound rude here, but each time I bring stealth, people don't agree with me. As simple as that. And then they, they tell me, oh, convince me, I can't. Because you already made your idea. And try to convince me, it will be the same. We cannot agree on that if you think they are fair. And that's fine, we all have our own take. Don't try to f uh, force out my troll, your idea. So here is my take on stealth. They have six moves. They have four vision. They can shoot anything, fighter, ground unit, naval unit. They are broken, in my own opinion. Here again, I said I'm not a high-ranked player. So I don't care about your analysis. can place one if you want other people to see it. I will leave it in the comment section. I, I'm not deleting any comments. Because I find that disrespectful for anybody that took time to write comments. But I won't agree with you and I won't read your analysis because I don't care. I've seen many people telling me, oh, it costs 29k instead of 24 because you need an APC. Look, the APC can do more than just giving for wall to the stealth. Usually, since I know APC are fine, they're actually good if well used. Uh, I will have APC even in game where I don't have stealth. But you see, it's not an argument. It's it's don't say it costs twenty nine. It it doesn't because APC are already part of your army. Now, if you lost your APC, of course you will need an APC to refuel your stealth. But that same APC can also bring other unit elsewhere. So it's not just for the stealth, your APC. It's for other stuff as well. Now, 24k. This is really low for everything it can do. It can scout. It can take the enemy by surprise. Uh, most of the time, stealth deal 5 damage to tank, 5 damage to anti-air. So... If you have tank and, and stealth, you can shut down the enemy front line. Of course, he will see you coming and he will have a fighter of his own. But the moment you reveal your stealth, if you play your stealth properly, you can remove it from, from the front line and kill anything it touches. 
and you will need to find yourself to shut it down with a fighter because only the fighter can shut down the stealth and here's the why i believe it's broken we have anti-air units they cannot do stuff if the, if, if the stealth is hidden if the stealth is hidden forget it you cannot kill it with anti-air cruiser missile uh pipe runner carrier you can't so this is in my own opinion frustrating that only one unit that worth 20k can shut down your stealth now of course other stealth can but if your opponent as a stealth on the battlefield don't try to beat him in the stealth game have a fighter instead it's much better and with jess stealth are really good because she don't even need apc even if they have weaker firepower they don't care she had good she has good tanks so as long as you're smart enough you can make good value on a stealth with jess stealth are broken they are not fun when i see stealth I'm always scared I see one. Sometimes there's a stalemate. But if one of the two players decide to go stealth, the stalemate is broken. Because it will take at least, depending on the map, two turns for the fighter to shut down the stealth if the defending player against the stealth is able to find the stealth. But that's a big if. There are other maps where it can take three to four turn for the fighter to reach the center or the area where's the stealth so the stealth are even worse in these maps so they, it's not fun it's not a fun unit oh yeah oh goodbye your tank goodbye your anti-air goodbye your front line goodbye your fun because now you will need to track down a hidden unit now how could I um, change the unit? How oh, the unit could be fixed? Because it has a lot of issue in my own opinion. Now, of course, Fuwal is a big issue with it. If you don't play properly yourself, they will crash. But even there, it's not enough. So here, here are the fix for the Celt. Make it 30k on its own. So for those who say, oh, with ABC is 29. I said on its own. Now it's fair because if it's 30k, this means the player that wants to sell need to save up some money. Except if the map has more than 60 properties and both players are at 30, but even they are evil base skip to have a stealth. Now at 30k it's a fair unit. Another way to make it uh nerf and to make it fair once you found a unit any anti-air unit should be able to damage it that's another way to nerf to nerf the stealth and i would be fine with it if anti-air can shut down stealth because now their value would drop people would not consider making stealth since they are not as good as bomber and it it would be a fair unit now, as I said, this is my take, this is my own opinion. I'm low ranked, I don't care about competitive play. I play with a lot of good player, competitive player. Because sometimes it's fun, you learn stuff. But even there, I know I won't be the best. I know you are not the best. Even if you believe it, there's always someone one day that will put you down, that will win. Does that mean he's better than you? Maybe, maybe not. But you will lose. So that's what I mean by there. Stealth are not fun. They break my fun. That's why when I, I do casual, I always ban stealth. Always. I don't have fun. And when I see Global League game with stealth, I don't have fun. And sometimes I will build a fighter because I'm scared of a stealth. Even if I have seen no iron unit, sometime out of fear I will make a fighter because I ate stealth. So with that being said, uh, I hope guys enjoyed my very huge rant about stealth. And like and comment and subscribe for more Advanced Wars content. 
I hope Jason Jade 